Hey guys, it's Fushtical and welcome back. We are starting a new um, challenge for Sims 4 and it's going to be the Crazy Cat Lady Challenge. Now, I had previously recorded an episode where I had created a whole house, created characters, created the cats, and then, uh, and then, and then obviously what happened was she decided to cook for the first or second time in that episode. And die. So that happened, which was awesome. Anyway, so what I did is I recreated. Uh, I didn't recreate her exactly, but I created a new one because I was done with that. Um, and I'd spent a lot of time on it, so I was just like, Ugh, no, I'm leaving it for now. So this is uh, this is Kimberly. Um, and I'm going, I'm going for like a young one, and I've got I've got some ideas of how I'm going to have this progress. So I'm quite excited. So we've got her, her everyday, her formal, her exercise. So she's relatively normal for now. Um, so that's cool. And we I've gone with. So the setting it this up is I have to have her as a cat lover, obviously and Alona so I figured go for a little bit erratic and a little bit crazy and that'd be fun and I, I get to have three cats um, so so we have three cats here we've got we got Whispers which is a um, a Tonks yeah that who, who's talkative and friendly and frisky and I'm um, gonna explore more explain about the setup and the challenges in a minute. I'm just going to introduce you to our lovely little kittens who aren't kittens. It doesn't say in it. Oh, it does say I have, it has to be adult cats. So they are adult cats. So we got a lazy, a fluffy, and an affectionate ragdoll. I kind of want them to be kind of true to their, their nature a little bit. So we've got, we've got lazy, talkative, and playful for our Scottish Bold called Kiergan, 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 whatever that is, and Cosmos. Um, so yeah, we've got to set up. I've got the house all sorted, and yes, so they all have a bad trait. The lifespan is set to normal, and we've then been moved into a plot. So I will give you guys a little show of that, and we're going into the house now, and I'll show you around that. So basically, the rules are: she cannot get a job. All the money, which doesn't matter, comes from her aunt who's, who has passed away. And here I, I left a tombstone of the, the previous woman. I'm going to pause this because stuff is going on. I'm going to show you around the house. So we've got a porch. Lovely looking. There's like no garden and stuff. But, you know, I feel like I'm going to change things up. So anyway, getting back to the rules. So the Sims... Sims social interaction can only be with her cats and if she speaks to another human or interacts it basically um, you have to break it up immediately and you can keep you can have the sim stay alive with a youth potion, youth potion if I can pronounce that and then once a cat dies you may add another one for adoption you may befriend strays and add them to the family you may breed two of your own cats and add ghosts of your beloved cats to the family. Ghost kittens may only be added if you previously owned them, so no strays from graveyards. And the challenge is completed when we have added seven ghosts of your cats to your family or your cats have been taken away due to neglect or loss. So I presume that is uh, as if I fail. Um, so, yes, kind of vague, but I figured it looked fun. Okay, so we're gonna go down to floor zero and we I've decided to go for kind of like a youth kind of like we've got that kind of almost start of the hoarding and, and little things and there's a lot going on. So we got like quite colourful house because she's colourful, she's edgy. And we've got we've already got oh look at that, look at all those those cats all over the place so um, I just I thought it'd be cool to kind of have a lot of colour, rainbowy. I like it. Not that I'd have my house that way. I mean, I might one day. 
But still, so we've got the bathroom. I kept it to the, the same layout as it previously was and the layout that the house came in. And we've got like the bedroom. So it's kind of like, oh, oh, didn't mean to do that. Um, so it's kind of like quite youthful. Um, got lovely little giant pictures of kittens and stuff. And I kind of, I've got some ideas of what I want to do as time goes on. So, yeah, I guess, I guess we dive straight into it now. Now I've kind of gone all that, like, so, so we're gonna just, my, my, my thing is in the way, so I can't actually see that part of my screen. I can now see it. Okay. Now, question is, so I thought, last time, fire alarm, didn't work. This will work. It didn't, it didn't work. You, you saw that. It didn't work. Okay, so let's not let's not dive into that. So so we're hungry and did I have a microwave? I need to have a microwave. Yes, I do have a microwave. I think we're gonna stick to microwaving for a little bit. It's a shame that I cannot learn to cook with a microwave because you can mess up cooking in a microwave really easily. I've done it. I've managed it in real life. And there is like there isn't skill to it, but there there is something there. So it can be quite skillful to make something really tasty in a microwave. So that should really be a skill. It should. It should be a skill. I once tried to make a melted chocolate in a microwave, and I burnt it, and the house stunk for ages of burnt chocolate, which is not the greatest smell. So what is our little adorable kittens doing? So our ragdoll is just, oh, it's just chilling. And, oh, that is a, where is that cat? It is there. It's just sitting there. And, and the other one ran somewhere. Oh, it's, uh, it's in the shower. Lovely. Okay, so are we not eating? Have we stopped? Where is your food? Where did that go? Oh, out of nowhere. Okay. So, I need to find something to do to fulfill. Ooh, and, like, just so you guys are aware, we've got plants and pictures all over the place. And it looks really cool and, and kind of crazy. And there's a lot going on. I like this thing, whatever this is. Look at that art. That's just because. Just okay. So. This is entertainment. Um, okay, so most of our interaction are, is Oz. Oh, don't know what that was. Is of the cats. Oh. So our interaction is only the kittens. So let's 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 pet them. <laughs> I'm an experienced cat owner. Okay, so we are obviously. See, I never play Sims correctly. Whenever I play Sims, I come up with some messed up storyline. <laughs> let's let's not get into that. Let's okay. So I'm not gonna. The cat doesn't want me to pet. Fine, that's fine. I will play with you, even if you're asleep. I don't care. So when I play in Sims on my own, and everybody does this it gets dark quite quickly. I do not care for the aspirations and the satisfaction. No, don't give a damn. I'm just there like, I'm in my storyline, I'm focused, and I love it. That's probably not the right thing to say with some of the things that I do, but it's not too messed up. But it gets dark, really dark. So I don't really care for this kind of thing, and I feel like because there's a lot of freedom I can do with this challenge in terms of, of what she can do. Maybe she can learn to cook. That would be a good one because none of my sims apparently have the ability to cook. And I'm not, I'm just going to do this because it's something to focus on. And, and that's, that's something. I'm not, if people have any ideas of, of, of what I can do exactly during the daytime while also trying to complete this because it's going to take some time so we, we need stuff to do 
Um, that would be awesome to be suggested. Because obviously I'm creative enough to come up with it myself. But, you know, still. Like, ooh. Oh, Aww, I can't get both of them in shot. That that sucks. Can I? Oh, can I zoom out? Oh, I can. Oh. oh I like that. That's cute. That's cute. That's awesome. Boom. Do this. Okay, I just want one. I just want one. I don't want any more than that. I don't care for that. Okay, so I'm going to interact with you. Oh. Have you been scratching? I don't want to request a song. I don't want that. So we're just going to interact with our cats today as we've moved into the house. They could be stressed out. Right, the cat's right in front of you, so don't say that that is not possible, because that is very possible. Me and Sims. It's a love-hate relationship, you know. Half the time... Half the time, Sims just refuses to do what I ask it to do. And the rest of the time, it's like... Yep. And then it just straight up kills off my characters. So we're just going to be happy, and we're going to play with the cats, and as, as entertaining as this is, it's quite it's quite a slow process. And we're going we're gonna to give this little guy, which may be female, doesn't matter, does not matter, um, attention. I always forget the words, the words that I want to say, if you guys haven't figured that out yet. But here we are. We're gonna praise because you just you're just chill, you're just doing you. I'm gonna plop. I'm gonna plop you down. What a word. So we're just, we're just gonna the cat's probably like, I don't care. Could you leave me alone? He's just looking at her like it doesn't matter to me. Just like what are you doing? Look at her. Look at him. It. He's just there like he just looks so unsatisfied. It's just like... He's <sighs> just staring off. Okay, so I'm getting quite tired. I'm she, she. I always do it as first person. Hmm. Hmm. So she's getting quite tired. And I never have to clean up after them. There's not a lot I need to do, really. I could, I could go. I've got to claim it. I could go in in the term in the route of training them. Not that I'd ever use that, because I mean I can leave the the house. I can leave the house. She's just not doing anything. So, but I can leave the house. I just cannot talk to anyone. I cannot get a job, but I can do things. She just leaves the lights on. Oh no, what what's wrong with this cat? One thing, one thing that is wonderful. These cats are quiet. They don't give a damn what I'm doing. They're downstairs. Look at them. Look at them. Look. They're asleep. And one's asleep. And the the others are gone. I don't know where they are. Oh, they're upstairs. Oh, now we're talking. But like, they they aren't barking at me. They're just doing their thing. They don't care. They are letting me sleep in. What is that noise? What is... Oh. Oh, I know what that is. So, we, we need to keep an eye out. Um, through for stray cats because in it it says I can befriend and add them to the family but I can, oh okay so I cannot befriend I cannot befriend cats ghosts that aren't mine and add them to the family so basically would it work? This is kind of a messed up fit. Actually, wouldn't work because that would be neglect, wouldn't it? They don't let you kill children or pets. I don't think. I don't think. I don't think Sims is like 
Yeah, do it. I don't think they're a bit against that, which I get. Ooh, should we risk it? We're gonna risk this, guys. We're gonna do it. We're gonna have scrambled eggs, and we're gonna die. If I die now, I said I'm done. I'm done with Sims. It's not happening. I've been through way too many times. Scrambled eggs and toast. We can't mess this up. We have four alarms. We have an extinguisher. We should have extinguisher. Before we do this, before we do this, I am going to cheat a little bit here. And I'm going to save it. Because I'm done with dying. Okay, fire alarm. I'm going to move this because I don't trust this. I can't move this. I'm moving it there. I cannot still put it there. I'm moving that. Okay. I want that there because I, you know, OCD. Everyone's got it. Okay. There we go. If it's closer, maybe we'll be all right. Maybe we won't. We won't have an issue. I mean, I don't trust Sims because I think Sims is out to just irritate me. So. Yep. How do you stop? How does a pet run away? Why does a pet run away? Oop! Cat poop. So, I'm gonna trust this one can cook. I'm gonna make sure she can cook. I probably need another person to stop it. Well, this cat doesn't not like that. No pet. Awesome. That was an awesome notification. Disappeared within a second. So she successfully cooked for the first time. Uh, it's usually the second time that gets me. Kills off my character and I swear Sims is doing it on purpose. It just knows. They know. So she's going to eat. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to fast forward this because it's just... As much as it's golden entertainment, it's just, there's just, we need, we just, yeah. So I need to keep a, a check on the premises to see if there's any, any cat snatching I can do. Can I steal? And, oh, what is this? It's a little dog. Okay. I don't care for you. It is a man fishing. And that is it. Oh, that's pretty. Another dog. So there is currently no cats in the area. We're gonna do I'm gonna do a daily surveillance. Surveillance? Yeah, we're gonna daily daily check the area for animals I could possibly snatch. And hey! 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 Sanjeevi Kumar. Yeah, that's what I thought. I don't care. See, ragdolls are like extremely quiet and the most easiest cats. Want one of the most easiest cats to look after. So this game just isn't staying true, is it? Hmm. <laughs> so. I guess I'm just gonna. Oh, there's actually rats. I thought it was cute and funny. You know, it's it's hilarious. But I, <laughs> I thought it was cute to have these little things in, and then the cat like Tom and Jerry. I should have called one Tom. But it actually has mice. It actually has mice, which I was not aware of. Now what am I gonna do? Because I need something to do. And I have nothing to do. I'm gonna bath. Can I bath them? No, you cannot bath cats. No, you can bath cats. <gasps> what? I can't. I can't. Can I interact? Oh, that's just messed up. What's she angry about? Vent to someone. Okay, a good event to you. Kill. 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 These cats are awful. Right. Or, oh, like, nah. I'm going to train you to be a little assassin. And you're going to murder them. That's what you're going to do. So going back to this. We are. We have. We have four more. Four more. Interactions. Friendly interactions with these cats. To fulfill. Until we've, we've done this stage. Oh. 
I didn't know what was going on then. Look, you can even see the the bloody thing. Yep, we're gonna we're gonna show how actually I didn't like that. There we go. That's what I want. There we go, I'm happy with that. And we're gonna interact okay, none of that did anything. I need to pet you. You're just gonna go in the furniture. I'm gonna get to know you. None of you are good cats. Cats are wait. You go to places like Cyprus and you go to places like Spain and there's cats everywhere. Everywhere. And they they're there to kill things like rats and and other creatures and lizards. Even though I don't know why you'd want to kill a lizard. Because some of them are so adorable. But these cats these cats don't care. They're just like, it's not my, my problem. Well, it's not good enough. And we completed that. <laughs> she, like, that, that erratic is, is perfect. Okay, so we're on the next stage. And this has been so thrilling. I need advice or tips or suggestions on what I can do exactly during the daytime to make this a bit more of an interesting, interesting thing. I will find cats. I will adopt them. Things will change and improve. And we've gotten to the next next stage where we have to be friends with five animals. So, yep. So if you guys have enjoyed this, then please like and subscribe. And until next time, have fun. <laughs>